Good morning, my wonderful friends. Make us with you on a beautiful day in Asha. And I want to entitle today's message, Power Thought. And with our thoughts of power, we can change form and matter. Everything you see in the world started with somebody's thought and idea. Every invention that you see. I want to, I want to read from Asha 9 and, and then... Uh, I want to talk about what's going on right now with this quarantine and, and the pandemic. And, and Asha 9 is really beautiful for teaching us to look at the solution and not the problem. It says, I am awakened to who I am. I have shed the illusion of the lower animal. I have let go of all air. I refuse to hold the vibrations, feelings, or emotions of the lie. I live only in the vibration of truth, Asha, God's highest idea of good. My eyes will not see nor ears hear the lion illusion. This is taking control of our focus. And when we take control of our focus and our perception, we take control of our lives. It goes on to say, I turn away if I sense bad energy. I turn away and remove myself if others choose bad energy. My friends, you can get sucked into negativity in a snap, hanging around negative people, by watching the news, people that like to talk about the worst case scenario, and they start to imagine it and speak about it. And my friends, they're going to bring that to fruition in their lives. Run from people like that. No one can force bad energy on me, for I am light. And in light there is no darkness. This opinion, our thought I hold, is the key to the kingdom. And this wisdom rules both worlds. We want to start ruling our world. How do we do that? We do that with power thoughts. Today, you can start saying things like, I am divine health. Sickness and disease dies when it touches me. Imagine that for a minute. Picture light in your body, every cell of your body, and it's emanating out of your body. And, and when those airborne diseases come and hit that light, they die instantly because they can't live in this atmosphere. Start saying things like, me and my children will live and not die and declare the works of the Lord. Start saying things like there's a hedge of protection around me and my family and my home. Envision that, see that light, see wherever you go you are in that light and darkness cannot enter. Darkness cannot enter light. Death cannot enter divine life. Sickness and disease cannot enter divine health. Become awakened to who you are. My friends, you are conscious energy vibrating in a form. You come from good spirit. You are made of good spirit. My friends, start to speak from that place, from that fravashi, not from your past mistakes, not from your past failures, not past from wrong ideas and DNA, past from your mother and father, grandfather and grandmother, but start to speak from that fravashi, that divine light inside of you. Start to create from that place and you will see magic and miracles in your life, my friends. Lay hold of what you want by proclaiming what you want. Start to speak to yourself and to others the highest truth, Asha, and watch your life transform. Let's, let's pull a card, my friends, and see what message we get from the cards today. Quick shuffle. Oh, this is beautiful. This goes along really well, guys. It's the Page of Swords. Uh, of course, swords are a suit of thought. Okay, and what are we talking about? Power, thoughts, pages, or new beginnings. Let's have some new thoughts. Let's let the old thoughts go. Uh, swords, their they're, uh, air suit, A-I-R. Uh, and, and so what do we, we want to rule the air. We want to rule the atmosphere. Uh, this pandemic, it, it's an airborne illness, isn't it? Screw that. We rule the air. We rule the atmosphere. My friends, you know this. I love you guys. Proud of every one of you. We'll see you tomorrow.